Hello everyone, I am Dr. Neha Gupta. I am a consultant obstetrician and gynecologist and a very important piece of information I am going to give you in this video and that is about the HPV vaccine. So HPV kya hai? HPV is human papilloma virus. This is the virus which is responsible for causing cancer of the cervix or cervical cancer. So uh, what is cervix? Cervix is the mouth of the uterus. Bachadani ke muh ko cervix kehte hain. Aur us cervix ke cancer ko kehte hain cervical cancer. And is cancer ke against, there is a vaccine available. The only cancer against which we have a vaccine. And it is the HPV vaccine. Naturally, jaisa name suggest karta hai, ye vaccine human papilloma virus ko target karti hai. So what is the ideal age to take the vaccine? The ideal age to take the vaccine is between 9 to 14 years. Yes, it has to be given to young girls who have not yet had their sexual debut. Yani ki kisi bhi prakar ki sexual activity shuru hone se pehle ye vaccine di jani chahiye. Uh, two doses are sufficient for girls who are less than 15 years of age and for women who are more than 15 years of age three doses of cervical cancer vaccine are required over a period of six months these doses are given so uh, just talking a little bit more about the age factor i said that the ideal age is between 9 to 14 years yes but catch-up vaccination is given even up till the age of 26 years और जो हमारी इंडिया की ऑब्स गाइनी सोसाइटी है जिसको हम फॉक्सी कहते हैं एस पर द रेकमेंडेशंस ऑफ फॉक्सी इंडियन वेमेन कैन एक्चुअली टेक दिस वैक्सीन अप टिल द एज ऑफ 45 इयर्स सो उसका लॉजिक ये है कि मोस्ट ऑफ आवर वेमेन आर नॉट वेरी रेगुलर विद देयर पैप स्मेयर स्क्रीनिंग्स दे डोंट कम फॉर देयर पैप स्मेयर स्क्रीनिंग्स ऑन टाइम एंड सो एट लीस्ट वो सर्विकल कैंसर की वैक्सीन लेने से दे विल गेट some protection against any abnormality developing on the cervix even though they are more than 26 years or even though they have been sexually active for a certain number of years. If I talk about the efficacy of the vaccine, the vaccine is highly efficacious. It offers almost 95 to 99% protection in young girls or you know, sexually naive girls. Uh, but like I said, uh, if you have been sexually active and then you are taking the vaccine, then the protection that the vaccine has to offer to you may not be that much, but it would still offer you a good 60 to 70 percent of protection. Vaccine is quite safe. It has been there in the market for more than two decades. So it has a very good safety data behind it. Uh, side effects are not very many. Uh, there can be mild pain on the injection side for a couple of days or there could be a local reaction like a little redness coming up over there. But usually nothing more than this is seen. The vaccine is given in the arm, in the upper part of the arm. And like I said, uh, two doses for girls less than 15 years and three doses for women who are more than 15 years of age. Um, the vaccine that is commonly given is uh, called Gardasil. It is a vaccine which is active against four strains of the HPV virus, HPV type 6 and 11, 16 and 18. So this is the vaccine which has been there in the market for a very long time. But very recently, uh, another uh, vaccination has come up which is active against nine strains of the HPV virus. We call it as Gardasil 9. There is naturally a cost difference between the, uh, you know, uh, the Gardasil 9 and the traditional old Gardasil. But uh, now these vaccines are the ones which are available in the market. So also, you know, newer uh, studies are coming up and in future, instead of three doses, we may get a guidance that only two doses are sufficient. That would be a significant, uh, you know, improvement because uh, it would reduce the cost of at least one shot of the vaccine. I would suggest that, uh, you know, I would rather say that investing in health is the most important investment that you can make in the current times. It's a huge step towards prevention of your own health. So please invest in this uh, because it's totally, totally worthwhile. I hope this was information, this information was useful and uh, thanks so much for watching. Thank you.